plan for today is uh, not have any water. All right, castaways, this is not a dream. And then bam, all the palm trees are just cut down. Fiddle, faddle, that's a word I haven't used in ever. Good morning, castaways and draconians. Draco Invictus here with episode six, day 11 of our playthrough of Stranded Deep. And if a few things look a little bit different, um, I did install some uh, some more high res textures on some stuff, and I just want to see how it looks. So I may be changing it back here, but um, I figured we'll play through an episode, see what we like, what we don't like, and we'll go from there. So the plan for today is uh, not have any water, apparently, or food for that matter. Yeah, we're just screwed. <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna have to get some coconuts. Let's do that. And uh, but the plan for today is actually um, some some building. Hopefully, uh, we're gonna tear down uh, some or cut down some uh, some palm trees. And here we go. Here's a lovely little coconut for us. And can we grab that one? Let's see. Got it. Okay. So we'll drop those on the ground. Uh, yeah. So we're going to have to, um, come here, you two. There we go. Gotcha. Uh, cut down palm trees. Uh, I want to thin out the other section. Like when we come through the cave over here. Now I know that we can't take out all the trees over here. And that's unfortunate. Like, we can take out these palm trees over here, but we can't take out, like, these. Which is a bummer. To kind of thin this area out a little bit. I'd love to have some trees in here, but we're just going to have to see how it goes. You know, take out any ficus trees. Um, and, of course, we've got our yucca trees here that need uh, some trimming and stuff like that. Like this one over here, too. But, uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's the plan, uh, so that we can start building our base, right? Gonna need lots of wood for that, uh, lots of materials. So, uh, that is what we are going to do. Let me drink this. See, look at the texture on the coconut here. See, that looks good. That looks really good. So, uh, let's go ahead and drop that. And we're going, well, I guess we only needed to drop one of them. Pick that up. There we go. We'll, we'll keep on this one for later. Uh, yeah, we're going to need more food. We'll have to go find a brontosaurus burger. Or uh, steak. Yeah. So, um, yeah, let's uh, let's get to it. I might as well start over here. Uh, wherever he is. See, this is why. Oh, God. Get lost. I also like the uh, the texture on the barrels. Cool. So let's. What do we have in this crate? Um, not much. Okay. So what I'm going to do? I'll cut down all the palm trees in this area, and um, and I will not going to force you guys to sit here and watch me cut down palm trees all damn day. But um, I will show you a few snippets, uh, maybe a little montage action going on there. But yeah, let's get this done. All right, castaways, it is quickly getting dark out there. We are switching over to the lantern now because the sun sets quickly around here. Now, um, in this area around the uh, the freighter ship here, I have cut down every palm tree, every ficus tree, and um, I have not picked them all up yet. So I am going to spend the evening while you guys uh, stay nice and cozy in the shelter. Uh, Getting this cleaned up and starting to work on the other areas as well. Uh, just starting to get everything organized. 
so that we can get uh, some materials. This is probably going to be a much shorter episode uh, than we normally do, simply because most of it is just going to be cutting down trees. So, um, yeah. yeah, as you can see, we have quite a few of the, uh, the heads of the palm trees around here. I put them all around this, uh, this water collector and, um, because these are much easier to store like this, but we've talked about that in other episodes. So I'm going to let you guys go ahead and, uh, curl up in the, uh, shelter here and, uh, don't mind the palm fronds uh, they're there to keep you warm and I need to go find something to eat. So I will catch you guys in the morning. Sleep well. All right, castaways, this is not a dream. I was up here because I noticed there was a yucca plant up here. And so I came up here to uh, to harvest it, get it going kind of a thing. And I found this up here, a spear gun in spear gun arrows. So I wanted to point this out to you guys because this is something that we have not seen thus far. I'm going to have to do a little research and find out how good spear guns are now but uh yeah let's jump oh god don't die let's get back up here oh god she can't jump or the crap can she oh yeah oh at least i didn't break anything oh am i stuck oh my god please don't be stuck either i was trying to get up there because i need to make a new axe ah <sighs> okay Anyway, I'm going to let you guys uh, doze back off um, because I know that there's two saplings up here. But I, I just noticed uh, that yellow bar there. We should be able to jump onto that. And there we go. Because there are two saplings right there. So I'm going to go get those. Do I have anything to cut them with? No, I have a pickaxe. Oh, that'll work. There we go. So, in a pinch, pickaxe. Uh, let's, uh, let's make, uh, some lashing. And, um... Oh, I can't get the achievement because I'm on a custom island. Okay. Oh, well. Lashing has been stored. What can I make now? Nothing. What am I missing to make a stupid axe? A stick. Okay. One stick it is. So you guys are going along on this journey. Oh, there's our stick. There's our axe. Okay. Cool. Go back to sleep. I'll see you in the morning. And good morning, castaways. I hope you guys slept well. It's uh, 6.15 in the morning. I am starving over here, um, and I I still haven't even finished this area. It took all night long, but I have lovely stacks of logs all around the place. Uh, but let's um, let's take a little a little constitutional, as they like to say. Uh, we'll come over here. We'll uh, grab some water. There we go. Full on water. We just need to go get some food now, which means that we have to go all the way back over to the boat. So I will see you guys over there. All right, guys. So here we are back over here at the boat and I got myself something to eat. Mmm. And that is a full four bars. So that's good to know. The large uh, meat is a four bar filler fantastic um and i don't know if i showed you guys the little shack that i mean we built up some walls uh from our planks that we had and i uh, need to put a little roof on this and um one of the things that i want to see is direction okay because our dock i think i think that that is north and we'll, we'll get a compass and, and to be sure, because uh, 
this raft, we're going to turn this into our, our hauler, right? It's probably not going to get any wider. Five is about as wide as I'm probably going to get it. But I'm going to square it up and uh, maybe make it a little bit longer. But when we pull it into the dock, I want it to be facing into the direction that the tide is going. And I think it's going this way. And if that's the case, then we'll build it so that we can pull in over here. And then when we're ready to pull back out, we'll just let the tide carry us away from the dock. Because this thing is not going to be easy to turn and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do with that. Uh, let me, well, hell, I might as well leave all of this crap over here. All, well, not the axe, but the rest of the wood. So I am going to uh, get that set. Yeah, this is, we may include another day. But once I get into editing, we may include a third day just so that we have a full episode. Um, because I think it's going to be just a lot of harvesting trees, which you guys know how to do that. So, um, I, I wish I could like phone a friend and ask you guys live. Um, you know, do you want to see more chopping trees? Do you want to see the whole process that I go through? And we'll just have to ask that for, um, uh, for later on, you know, but for right now, I think uh, I'm going to skip most of the cutting tree stuff. And um, then you guys have to tell me down in the comment section. Do you want to see the whole process? Or do you want to see the curated process of me not cutting down all of these palm trees? Me going, look, I need to cut down all these palm trees. And then, bam, all the palm trees are just cut down. Let me know in the comment section below. What would you rather see? Do you want to see me go through axes and 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 wrestle with palm trees? Or do you just want to see the finished product? Let me know. Because right now, I'm thinking finished product. Well, anyway, I'm burning daylight. I better get back to uh, finishing up over there. So, um, I'll see you guys in just a second. Whoa. Get that going. Ooh, here's another one. There we go. All right, guys. Another day of just getting everything settled. Uh, we got a, I collected all the coconuts and the rocks and the sticks and all that good stuff. So, um, the one thing I want to do is uh, create a uh, another plank station. So let's see what we need for a plank station plank station so we need a refined axe which is over on the other side of the boat we already had that it got down to like two percent and i was like oh i better save it for the plank station so we need four sticks i have the lashings so let's grab four sticks and i think that's all that we need to jump over all this crap let's run over here now, we're not going to turn all the logs into planks, but um, planks stack better than logs do. And we're going to need a crap ton of uh, planks, so. Uh, yeah, there's our axe. So now, uh, if we center here, we should be able to. There it is, plank station. And uh, we built one of these on the, the first island, if you guys remember. And so we're just gonna put it here. There we go. It used the ax off the ground. It also uh, used the, uh, the, the uh, crude hammer that I made. Oh God, now we lost our leg. Uh, let's drop this right here so we can see what the hell we're doing. Pick that back up. And now let's uh, make planks out of all of these logs sitting over here. The quick craft system is very nice, to be sure. So 
so you don't have to fiddle faddle that's a word i haven't used in ever <laughs> so you don't have to jack around with the uh, regular build menu the quick craft is much nicer and uh that's it for that whole pile that's crazy all right so um for tonight um i am going to cause yeah see i look at my total time recorded because i record everything um and it looks this okay i'm not gonna add a third day so this i am going to come over here we're gonna try and find the shelter buried underneath all the palm fronds and it's right here there we go let's pull out our light again and i am going to bid you guys a good night um in the next episode, we are uh, going to start laying out our uh, our base. I mean, properly. I don't even know why I built that other shelter over there. Because it's we haven't used it at all. So, anyway. Uh, that is going to wrap it up for this one, guys. I know it's a very short, weird one. And I apologize for that. I'm trying to keep better content uh but yeah this is just one of those ones where it's like okay we're just doing a bunch of cutting crap down so again let me know in the comment section do you want to see that kind of stuff you want to just kind of hang out with me and i'll bullshit with you guys while i'm cutting down trees all episode or would you rather just see hey look here's where we're working with and bam we're done and then we can move on to other things but that might require us doing more than two days in an episode. It might be three or four if two and a half of those days were spent cutting down trees. Uh, because the time for me is all the same. It's just uh, the perception of time for you guys. Anyway, go ahead and crawl into the shelter. Stay warm under the palm fronds. And I will wake you guys in the morning. Until then, you take care of yourselves out there. This is Draco Invictus saying this has been the best day in my life. See ya.